Hi everyone and welcome to another episode of Avoria Prime Performance Reviews. This time we will be discussing the month of January 2024 and we will be also giving a full overview of the results for 2023 of the different tools Avoria Prime has on offer. Let's dig in. First of all, as I promised, from now on we will also be showing the results for Gearbox because Gearbox is actually um, the oldest software that is still running with AP. So let's start from right to left instead of left to right as we have usually done. Gearbox. In January Gearbox did about 10.5% of profit and from beginning of January up to now, today is the 18th of February, Gearbox has done about 12 percent profit and for last year the account one of the public accounts that I found did about 50 percent profit running only one pair USD CAD which is the best performing pair with gearbox and it was running on swing settings so try getting such results with only one pair running this is pretty cool next flash with flash there's several accounts that I'm looking at but I chose to display the account that is making lower profits and has lower drawdown because this is uh, how to say all the accounts that I show are real accounts the only difference is that for many people the risk levels for some accounts are unacceptable for example uh, the account that I have been uh, showing before in January made a whopping I think 11 12 percent profit but with such kind of profits, uh, you have to be aware that uh, the drawdown is going to be substantially higher. And the account that made this 11-12% profit uh, last month made over 140% profit through the last year. But right now it's sitting in quite a bit of drawdown. So I will be showing the account that is that has more modest settings from now on. With Kratos X, Kratos X is the Kratos version that is running only on gold and right now Dominic is working really hard on finding the, the best um, settings for Kratos 6 and there might be a feature coming out where it's not going to be taking any more managing trades but instead closing losing trades and opening new trades that are going to be winners. But for now Kratos 6, this account that I'm looking at, this is actually one of my beta test accounts Last month it made a little over 9% profit and from the beginning of January up to now it has made around 14% profit with, with drawdowns of around 20% which is actually really good considering what gold has been doing in the recent months. With Kratos I will be showing my own account from now on. Uh, last month it made 1.94% which is quite modest but also looking at the, uh, the market, the market is kind of sleeping still sleeping and I know some people get annoyed by it because there are monthly subscription fees that they have to cover uh, I usually say that okay you just have to have enough patience last year the account that I've been looking at for most of the time made over 50% profit and this is I mean if, if this is not good enough I don't know what what's going to be good enough for you um, the second thing is that your account size has to be big enough so if your account size is not big enough that such profits cover the monthly fee then you have to increase your account size of course that will be up to you how to solve this uh, situation if you will just continue uh, don't increase your settings to be more risky because now uh, you might find yourself in a position where you have to start managing manually or you will not be able to sleep anymore because now you have taken on a lot more risk when the market actually started moving. From January up to now my account has made around 3.14% in profit. With social trading as you can see Fingo Pro 4 is no more so uh, in the first days of January Fingo Pro 4 actually got a margin call and all the people who were in Fingo Pro 4 they also got a, an official email just recently from AP uh, with some offers on how to continue uh, working with AP. Hopefully that's enough. But when it comes to results of the Fingo Pro solutions that are still running, Fingo Pro 1, I have no data for this year. 
Uh, last year it made around 28%, which is not bad. Pingo Pro 2, uh, where now the trader that was running it last year, the gold trader, he's back. And I'm actually really happy that the company did bring him back, even though he caused a huge drawdown, he was capable of uh, trading his way out of that drawdown. And that was really beautiful to see because if you are under such high pressure to perform and you still perform, it means that you're a serious guy, you know what to do. And I'm expecting big things from Fingo Pro 2 onwards also. Last month, Fingo Pro 2 made about 16% profit. And uh, people who started in January, for example, up to now, they have about 26% profit looking at them on their account. Last year, even though there was about 70% drawdown at one point, the year still ended in net profit of 23.63%, which shows really good things about that trader. With Fingo Pro 5, that is running on Kratos, you can see that the markets have been kind of sleepy. Uh, Fingo Pro 5 made around half a percent in January and from the beginning of January up to now, so it's about one and a half months, uh, Fingo Pro 5 has made 2.79%. In the future, um, there are talks that Kratos X and also Radar will be uh, running on Fingo Pro 4 uh, together with the usual Kratos to increase profits while the markets are kind of sleepy. For last year, Fingo Pro 5 made over 30%, which comparing to more traditional ways of investing is a really good result. When it comes to Fingo Pro 4, um, this was a really important lesson for the company. So if you are one of the people who was in Fingo Pro 4 or who has been in any of the Fingo Pro 4s or who is considering social trading, I would seriously take a look at it because now they have automated limits on all of the Fingo Pro 4s. Um, the company was too trusting of traders, of fund managers previously, and now this is no more. So they have automatic stop loss at 20% drawdown. So something like what happened to Fingo Pro 4 cannot happen again. And I'm really happy about the company did implement these changes going forward. Last but not least, let's talk about Crypto Advantage. With Crypto Advantage, um, in January it made about 0.4% and this is basically uh, uh, what it has done since January. And it is quite dormant with John Wick signals. Why am I showing this is because now we also have Radar from next month. We'll be also showcasing the results of Radar. You can't expect Radar to be having the exact same results as John Wick because it works in a different way. It gets all the signals that John Wick gets and it opens the trades that John Wick signals would open, but it uses a trailing stop loss or a fixed take profit and a fixed um, stop loss that you can actually adjust. So the results will be different from John Wick signals. They could be better, they could be worse. Only time will actually tell what the results are going to be. With John Wick signals, if somebody traded John Wick signals last year and took all the positions that John Wick signals did and would have hold, hold out the trades uh, for as long as possible, they would have made about 370% gain last year, which is kind of crazy. Just imagine that. So this is the summary of January for 2024 and also the summary of 2023 altogether, what the results were. I can say that 2023 was a good year, uh, excluding Fingo Pro 4. Fingo Pro 4 was a really hard lesson and apparently the, and apparently the company has learned from it. I also hope that the customers learned from it and will not give up. We'll continue with the tools Warrior Prime has right now because the tools we still have some of them have been working for years now which is actually really good really cool because it's really difficult to see and find products that work long term there are so many EAs out there there's so many offers out there and they come and go one month three months six months maximum maybe one year and, it, and it's gone poof but our prime has results for years consistent results for years for some of the products that our prime has been working on with 2024 
I expect the results to be good because last year and the previous year have been good. Of course, past results never guarantee future profits. So keep that in mind. And if you are um, impatient, if you are thinking about what's going on with Kratos, why is it not making much profit? It's because of, the, it's because of what's going on on the markets. Kratos can only trade what the market gives. So have patience, keep yourself calm, uh, go hang out with your family, go do other stuff because Kratos will be just watching out for your money and your profits. You don't have to put a lot of time into it. This is it for this time. If you have any questions, let me know. If you have any comments, leave your comments and talk to you in about one month. Oh, 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 oh,